Okay, today I'm going to show you how to upload a video and also retrieve a video that you already have on YouTube back to your files in your laptop, your documents. And we'll get started here. Now, if you have videos uploaded on your phone, which you have taken with your your phone, you would simply click the share button on your video and then click on YouTube and it would automatically upload to YouTube. But be sure to keep it at private until you have done all the editing you wish to do. So now we'll get started assuming you have a video on your laptop. We go up to the upload button. You would click on that. And that brings you to this page. Select files to upload. And as you can see, this says public. You can change that to private until you have it exactly the way you want it before you actually publish it. You just click on private. Then you would upload your video. And a screen will pop up with your pictures, videos, whatever. Um, and then you would click on one. Double click. And it will bring it up. Now that's going to take a while to upload and process. A um, few minutes. Then, in the meantime, you can just do all your editing. You have basic info. You can add a description, your title, tags. Like I would put, take this out of here. And I would put in cooking, baking. Always put commas after each tag. And there you go, and that's what happens. And then you go to the next one and type it and put another comma. And these are tags so that people can find your video. They could type in baking and your video will pop up. So these are some, and then monetization, if you want to make money from your video and you have that enabled, you can do so. You would just click on that and a little box will pop up to tell you to click on it to monetize. Translations, if you want to have that in different languages too. And then you have your advanced settings. But before you go to any of the others, you make sure you save. Oh, oh the save button isn't right there. You just have to go over and get these done first and then you save. I'm sorry about that. Um, so now we'll go to advanced settings here. You can change any of these different categories here. Recording date. You can put that in. And let's go down a little bit here so you can see whatever you wish to do here. Now once your video is done, and it's telling me the processing is done, now we go back to Upload again. Now before we used this section. Now your video is already been uploaded. So now you go over to the right. You go down to the scissors here. And you click edit. 
if you want to change anything if you want to just keep the video the way it is just make sure you set it back to public if not you can do some more editing right here and all your videos should pop up here and you would drag whichever video it is I'm going to drag this one now actually I already have one on there so I'm going to X one of these out of here I'm going to X this one out just use that one now if you'd like to add a bit of music to your video you go up here and you click on the music now remember that if you don't use copyright free music you will not be able to monetize And there are some sections for copyright free music. But you can decide whichever music you wish. If you click on the play button, the tune will play for you. And you just keep going till you find what you like. We'll start with this one. Let's see. And that one will play. But I have it turned down right now. So maybe you like that, so you drag that down to for the music. And there you go. Then when you're finished with your editing, if you wanted to cut something out of your video, maybe a bit from the beginning or a little bit from the end, I'll say I'm doing it from the end, I go to this blue bar and I bring it in closer like that. That cuts out a lot of it at the end and then if you wish to do it from this side you would do the same thing and when you're ready after you've you might want to auto fix do these little things here pan and zoom and they will also stabilize your video for you now once all this is done and you've done all your if you want to change the filter which are different like gray or black and white or different things like this you can click on that then once all this is done you go over here and you click create video I'm not going to create a video because I already have that uploaded to YouTube so now you should be all set and you make sure you change back to public from private and your video will be published on YouTube. Okay, now from the same screen that you were on to edit your videos and you want to retrieve a video and put it back into your files, you go back up here and you click on this you go to Creator Studio and it will bring you here. Now, you already see this, but it will not bring up the MP4 download until you go over to Video Manager and then to Videos. And this should pop up my MP4. Yes, it's right there. So you would go down to, from the drop down menu from the video you selected, you would go down to this download MP4. You would click on that. And at the bottom of the screen, it will ask you do you want to save or save as and you can pick a name to save it as and it will be back on your computer wherever you wish to save it I'm gonna cancel because I already have that one saved now that should be it with that 
Now you can go back, press the back arrow, and if you don't forget, if you want to do any other enhancements, always go to the edit button by going to upload, and it will bring you right to these scissors here on the right side. You click edit. And it will show you, you can do, well, you can even do them from the drop down menu from the Creator Studio here, from all the edits here. You can click edit and you will see different things here. Basic info, advanced settings. Basic info. Oh, uh, wait a moment. You can go back to... Yes, I always end up going back to Video Manager. It seems to show me a lot more there. And you click on the drop-down menu. You can do anything here. Settings, Enhancements. Audio, if you want music. So you can do all this again. Annotations, cards, if you want to add something to the video that pops up during your video to let the public know your channel or the title of other videos, your playlists. And there you have it. Simple as that. If you have any questions, please let me know and have a good evening.